On nine different occasions, car owners in Bloomfield had their catalytic converters stolen. All those thefts took place in a four day window. And on more than one occasion, witnesses saw three men in ski masks. News 12 in Jersey's Chris Keating reports. Thieves are targeting all makes and models of cars when it comes to stealing catalytic converters. Some are parked on streets, others in supermarket parking lots. In Bloomfield, police are reporting nine stolen between May 3rd through the 7th. The thefts spread throughout the town. One of these catalytic converter thefts happened right here on Monroe Place in Bloomfield. A witness is telling police they looked outside and saw three men in the middle of the street in ski masks. They were right alongside an Acura, and the car was jacked up on a car jack. At that point, the witness says they saw one man go underneath and take out the catalytic converter. The witness saw the suspects get away in a Chevy SUV. It was reported as either gray or champagne in color. In another case, thieves targeted a delivery man at a building along Broad Street. The driver told police he was inside picking up medical supplies, left his vehicle for only 18 minutes. When he came out, the catalytic converter was gone. The catalytic converter hooks to your exhaust and turns your car's harmful toxins into carbon dioxide, but it contains precious metals, including platinum, and the part alone can cost between five to nine hundred dollars. The U.S. attorney recently reported the arrest of four men who were coming across the George Washington Bridge to New Jersey, stealing the pricey car parts and then driving back to NYC. However, with the help of a witness, police were able to make an arrest of all four. The suspects found with seven of those catalytic converters valued at $5,600 in total. In Bloomfield, I'm Chris Keating, News 12, New Jersey. Now, witnesses in Bloomfield spotted the suspects getting away in a Chevy SUV that was seen at other locations. Once stolen, the catalytic converters are either sold for cash at scrapyards or used for resale.